Okay, we are up. Okay, Rob, so here's the story. I've been trying to record this for like an hour at least, so we're going to see if this one works. Um, happy Christmas. I'm doing a Let's Play video for you because poetry sucks and everyone hates it. And I'm just going to do Let's Play instead. Do Mario, and we're going to go ahead and just freaking rock this, sh rock it out. I can swear because mom is probably going to be watching this a little bit. Um, yeah, so uh, Super Mario Flash Brothers uh, is a video game that was created by Shigeru. Ma it was created by nine year olds, I think, um, who got good at this game, got good at making Flash. I remember when I was good at Flash. I remember when I was good at Flash? Yeah, anyway. So this is a pretty easy level. Um, I played it a couple hundred times earlier today because I was just trying to get this thing to record and it didn't really record for me ever, which was kind of a downer. Um, I'm trying to speed run this. Um, I got five lives. Once I run out of live, that's the end of my run. So I make this count. Everything's a lot of tension, a lot of really tough shits going down because I know, you know, I fuck up. I really don't want to redo this one more time because I'm tired. It's like 2 a.m. It's the night before Christmas. Um, I guess it's going to be easy to get to sleep. Usually I have a really hard time getting to sleep in Christmas Eve because I'm anticipating my presence. Got to the flag. Just did it. I'm good. I'm good at the game. My hair is literally falling out of my keyboard right now. So, alright, moving on. Just keep it going. Just keep going. This is the underground level. It's really hard. There's a bunch of this. I never, I got it past it once. There's this really hard jump that doesn't make any sense. I'm going to get the mushroom in this case. Um, okay, so in this game, the green shells do not track off stage, as you're going to see. Look, they didn't track off stage. So I was able to bypass the challenge using my superior technical knowledge. Okay, died. Um, okay, all right, get back in there. Luigi. Luigi in this game, I think, jumps higher. I have not played as Mario, so I can't confirm that fact. Okay, get the mushroom, dodge the, the piranha. I wanted to point out earlier, I don't understand why piranhas don't come up when you're standing on top of them. I think that would add like a whole extra element of kind of danger. Oh my god, I'm not gonna be able to get it. Oh, I did get it. Okay, cool. I mean, they respawn off stage. It's the most chintzy ass um, Mario game ever. Do you think so? Oh god, I missed it again. Okay. Uh, Robert, um, so I wanted to say. We li we're living together right now. It's really special. I mean, it's sort of special. I mean, the fact that, like, we're kind of doing the same thing we did when we were teenagers is, I mean, oh. Okay. Well, you were always better at video games than me. I think you're still better at video games than me. Um, you're doing web developing right now, which is great. I can't, I want you to move out so I can live in your apartment or I can visit you in your apartment. Don't get any roommates. Or, I don't know. Probably going to get, like, some weird... CS student roommate or something like that. It's like ironic ass motherfucker. Um, you know, just some guy who's like, it's gonna be not. Don't live with Sam fan. I mean, like, I hope. So. Okay, that might have been my last life. No, I got one more. Okay. Don't live with Sam fan. I don't think Sam fan is a, a good kind of good person to live with. You should live. You maybe like date someone and live with them. Then I don't know. I mean, like, it's too. You, you shouldn't, like, move in with people you're dating, I've heard. It's probably, like, a bad idea. But I know a lot of people are doing it. I mean, I think that probably people are going to start getting married pretty soon, which is kind of weird. I mean, I'm not really... I mean, I don't. I can't get married. I, all my my romantic relationships have ended. I don't know if you noticed this. I talk about this a lot, but the fact that I'm, my love life is almost over. It's like... Oh, wait, there's a firefly right here. There we go. Yeah, that's nice. Um, Super Mario Brothers was developed by Shigeru Mayanimo in 1929 as an alternative. Okay, cool, got that. Fuck that guy. To um, Kellogg's for, as an anti masturbation device. I actually recently learned that the game was. You see what happened there, though? Okay, that's a game over. All right. Um. Where are we at? What time are we at here? What is? Got about almost. Okay, so we got another five minutes. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go for it again. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna stay with Luigi. Keep it. Keep it good with Luigi. All right, and just get through this really quick. Um, I'll speed run it, so I'll just hold right. I won't let go right. 
See if I can make that. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, that was a bad idea. I'm not gonna do that. I spend a lot of time watching other. I watch, watch a lot of other people play video games right now. I mean, is it a depression thing? I think it's easy to sort of talk about depression as if it's like the, the dictating everything in my life in a way. Um, I mean, I haven't been diagnosed as depressed. I'm kind of just using the term. I don't know, man. I think, like, you know, I think the way society works is you can just rejoin it anytime you want. I guess, like, for us, it's really easy because of all... I don't know. I mean, when we talk about privilege, it's such a weird conversation to have. This is like me, you know, this is, this is me This is me playing a video game right now. God, oh, fuck. Okay. This is the hard part. I'm doing this in the basement. I'm doing this in Dad's studio. I had to push all his tools on the ground, and um, I, I'm probably going to clean it up. If I don't clean it up... I didn't clean it up, it was me. Oh, God. Okay. It was me, Dad. I did it. Well, let's try Let's go visit the toad housing and maybe get an extra life or something. Okay. I know that the middle one's a star, probably. So, yeah. Open it up. Oh, fire flower. I don't even know how to use these things, actually. Is it the select? Is there a select button? I don't really care. I don't know. This is the first level. I'm not going to beat it on this one. Robert, I will always remember the way that you put mines on this, the land speeders in Star Wars Battlefront so you could kill your enemies by landing your land speeder on them on the AT&T and then shooting rockets into, into its head with the heavy class. I will always remember how you learned that the heavy class is actually more powerful than the Star Wars. I mean, that was just a shining moment in your person, I think. It's just the way that you were able to just, like, wreck on that game and just develop new strategies and just, like, beat every other two-year-old who played that game. You did a great job with that. I think that was just an amazing thing you did. I don't know amazing, but, you know, just demonstrative. You know, the way you beat me and Jeffrey and Smash Brothers, although I think I really would have beaten you if I had a better controller. John, this is John. Okay, what? was, I don't know, I'm still kind of, I was mad about that all day. I was so salty about that. Because, you know, I don't know, it just sticks with you. It's an emotional commitment. We talk about this kind of thing. Shout out to Jeffrey. Shout out to Adrian and Julie for planning this whole thing and making it come off. I mean, Ju Andrew, Andrew, Adrian, Adrian, I think, needs to chill a little bit, as usual. Um, yeah, I got this shell. It's a lot of points for me. Okay. So, um, Adrian, how's NPR doing? Okay, okay, in this space, Adrian can now can now respond. All right, so all right, I'll, I'll I'll phrase the question, Adrian, and then you respond. Okay, Adrian, how's NPR doing? Okay. Um, do you think they're gonna promote you? Why? Okay, this is going to end the segment. Thanks for joining me today. I got the... Okay. Oh, man. All right, I got one life left. And then we're just going to call it... Uh, call it over. I've been really tired. I'm not really tired. It's, just, it's hard to... You know, it's hard to make... It's hard to make stuff like this. People, It's hard to make art. So screw the haters, you know? I mean, poetry, I don't know. Poetry, I think it's pretty easy. But art, I mean, like, you know, film. It's hard to do. Uh... My one friend thinks I have a, I have a, I have a career in, in filmmaking. Okay, that was it. Is that it? No, I got one more. Is Toad going to help me out more? I'm not going to go to Toad. All right, I think I hear someone come upstairs, so I'm going to make this quick. I'm going to get through this. I mean, I guess I'm, I'm just going to my own death at this point. I'm not, I'm not really planning on, what, on winning, much like in real life. Um, You might have just watched all the, Okay, that was it. All right. So long, Robert. I hope you enjoyed your Let's Play video. This is my gift to you, a creative gift. Um, have a good day, and I hope you got something cool for Christmas. All right, bye-bye.